Hello, I'm Nicolette. Today we're going to make a lotus flower. So all I've got in here is an, a napkin um, or a serviette, whatever you prefer to call it. You can actually get origami uh, paper, but if you're sitting in a restaurant or a pub and you're waiting and you're getting a little bit bored or you want to impress your friends, then you can always use a napkin. So this is it's a Christmas one and it's not even Christmas, but anyway. <laughs> So here we go. So all we need to do, it's quite simple. You can see the creases here. So you could actually fold yours first. Luckily mine's already got the creases in, but you could fold yours in half and then in half again to create those creases. So all we're going to do is get it and put it into the middle. Try and make it as neat as possible because it makes it easier. Fold outwards like that. That makes it a little bit easier to do. And we're going to do the same all the way around and try and keep it point see here I'm trying to keep that nice and straight into the air but there we go and the same here try and keep that point yeah so that's bit when you've got a tissue that's a little bit soft it isn't easy it isn't easy um, but this tissue's not too bad or origami paper um, so do the same on that. If you push outwards, it just makes it a little bit easier rather than trying to do that. It seems to mess it up when you do that. And then we're going to do the same again. So we need to go right into the middle again. There we go. Straight again. And then all the way around. Outwards. Yeah, outwards from the middle makes it a bit easier. Sorry if I'm not keeping it in <laughs> view of the camera. Round. How many times? That's one, two. We need to do one more on this side. I always lose count. <laughs> so that's two. If you lose count, you can just have a quick look underneath you, but be careful. And then we need to do one more. Yeah. Out. Another way around again. If I'm going too fast, pause the, pause the video. Um, I actually, if you, find, if you have a look on my videos, there's different playlists and I've done loads of different things. You will find cartoon draw-alongs on there where I will show step-by-steps -steps of how to do cartoons. So that's that. Um, I've got activities, games like 2P football, um, how to make flower bombs, um, lots of different things on there. So I've done that three times. And we're going to turn it over like that and we're going to do the same again so nice and simple into the middle and you just make this as crisp as possible make the edges nice and crisp yeah. keep, i always keep my thumb in the middle if i can so it doesn't lift because if it lifts you it, you lose it a little bit so oh mine's got a little bit wonky let's straighten that out There, that one. I know this is a magic bit. So I'm going to show you. I wouldn't do this with yours, but I'm going to show you underneath because it's fiddly. You have to keep it together. But here, you've got these all the way around. So what I'm going to do, you can feel underneath. Keep it on the tape. Feel underneath, and you can feel it. So put your finger here. Have a little bit of pressure and pull it up. And then if you give it a little nip, it just makes it neater. So we're going to do that all the way around. So put your finger in a little bit, be gentle with it. There we go, do a little bit more. And the same here, just bring that one up. A little pinch at the end, all the way around. So, and then again, I'm going to show you mine, but don't turn yours over because it might fall off. I've got more here. If you remember at the beginning, I did three. So we're going to have three. We've got the first set, this is the second set. Okay, like that. So you can adjust these later to see how, what, how you prefer it. Um, and then you'll see some more. With these, you have to be a little very careful and very gentle because they could rip. So be very, very careful with these. Don't give it a tug, just gently. I would just gently lift it rather than giving it a little bit of a tug, but you've got to be. Careful it doesn't rip. So 
there we go that is your lotus flower you can then tweak it a little bit however you want it try and make it neater and um, so that is how to make origami lotus flower what i have done in the um, description if you have a look in the description i have shown a step by step guide i've illustrated a step by step guide um, that you can follow if you don't want to follow the video again it'll just show you how to do that so it's three times one side one time and then we can pull those up to make the flower um, yeah and again look on my video you'll find some draw alongs because i illustrate and i write children's books so you could find some links to those i think there's almost 50 i think i've got 49 draw alongs on there mainly animals um, and aliens and robots and all sorts of different things monsters so thank you very much for watching i hope you enjoy making flowers and i hope if you're hungry it can keep you entertained in a restaurant while you're waiting for your food and um, i will hopefully see you next time